Examine your problem areas. Hey there! When you have made the decision to incorporate healthier habits into your daily life, it can be a bit overwhelming. After all, a quick internet search will yield thousands upon thousands of suggestions. If you're feeling a bit overwhelmed, know that you are not alone and we are here to help. The first question always is, or should be, is where to start? An easy place to begin your new lifestyle is to look at where you're currently sitting, and where you eventually want to be. You start this with running over your day-to-day -day life with a fine-tooth comb and making small changes. Most people are creatures of habit, so this may not be the most comfortable task. But it's a good idea to address your problem areas first. For example, if you're somewhat of a sedentary person then you'll definitely want to start exercising. But you can't just go from being a couch potato to hitting the gym for an hour every day. Your body just isn't used to it. Not only will you have to gradually incorporate physical activity into your life, you'll also have to address the pink elephant in the room, why haven't I been exercising all along? Find out your reasons and change them, whether you commit to waking up earlier or cut back on your evening couch time. Or perhaps one of your problem areas has to do with nutrition. If that's the case, you're not alone. So many of us love to pull out our smartphones and get food delivered. A lot. But while it's fine to treat yourself from time to time, it's not something that you should do every day. So, ask yourself, why am I always getting food delivered? Is it for the convenience or the taste? If you just love certain food, then search for healthy ways to make it at home. And if you're doing it more for the convenience, then join the many people who are all about food prep. If you work outside of the home, then chances are good that you have a vending machine full of sugary and high-fat snacks, and that's a recipe for disaster when those mid-morning and late-afternoon hunger pangs kick in. When we get hungry, we tend to eat with our eyes first. Vow to prepare your snacks for the week and bring them in, making sure you don't get that 3 o'clock candy bar. If you'd like even more tips on how to make small, lasting changes that will add to your quality of life, then head on over to One Medical. They have your best interest in mind with some amazing nutritional hacks. It won't be long before your local restaurant is calling you to see if you're okay. HTTPS colon slash slash www.onemedical.com slash blog slash eat dash well slash 12 dash nutritional dash hacks. That's it for today. In tomorrow's email, we'll talk about why you should invest in a blender. Until then.